Muungano wa wahadhiri wa vyo vikuu nchini Uasu umesisitiza kuwa mgomo wa wahadhiri bado upo na utaendelea. Ukipuzi lia mbali yale madai kuwa wamepokea nyongeza kutoka kwa serikali. Matumaini ya wanafunzi wa vyo vikuu vya umma kuwatarajia masomo yao hivi karibuni yametibukia nyongo baada ya muungano wa wahadhiri wa vyo vikuu nchini kukanusha kupokea nyongezo yoyote. We wish to categorically state that the so-called offer from the government is yet to reach the recipients universities academic staff union Wahadhiri wa vyo viku nchini walianza mgomo wao siku 29 zilizopita kwa kile wanachodai ni serikali kwa hada kwa kuto watekelezea mkataba wao wa makubaliano al maarufu CBA The pensions component is yet to be offered by the government but we read in the papers that the government has offered 5.2 billion that is non existent it is a figment of imagination and we are yet to sit down with the government wameisuta wizara elimu kwa wahadhiri watakuwa naajiriwa katika mfumo wa kandarasi wakipinga kutumiwa kwa maafisa wa polisi kuwalazimisha wanafunzi kutulia vioni you cannot expect a don who has studied for more than 20 years you have attained your masters you have attained your phd then you are told that you will be employed on contract that one will never happen. Then it means university academic staff will be on strike forever. Whoever thought that if you think that you can employ dons on contract, forget it. Wameapa kuendelea na mgomo wao bila kusuasua hadi matakwa yao yote atakapotekelezwa. These are all officials of the union from the 31 universities. They have categorically informed me that no university in this country has received ever a penny. And I want to tell IPUCCF to tell members of the public where this 5.2 billion is so that we can go for it. And this time, don't think we'll call off this strike before our members get their money. Willie Lusige, KTN News. Union,